Okay, ready? To the Q band in three, two, one. Get the platforms in order. These are the sounds of a late night show coming together. Hours before the guests arrive, nearly 20 volunteers completely reconstruct Studio A. Student volunteers build platforms, construct desks, and set lighting to transform the studio into the set of late night at North Texas. The people behind the camera are the ones that make the show happen. So then after you get the drummer jersey, go to the guitar. Okay, do a medium shot of him, so see his head? Right there? Cool. Producers, writers, and directors spend the week heading up to late night, planning every meticulous detail. The week before a show, we usually have our guests booked, so we have an idea of what we're getting into. So we typically have a writer's meeting on Thursday nights. And in that writer's meeting, we plan the segments out and we uh, discuss how we're going to need monologue jokes. We also like to run through the monologue a couple times the night before with our, our host so that we know he's comfortable and confident and maybe work up things he could possibly say during the actual taping. Speaking of a dangly parts, a new dating app. <laughs> A new dating app for marijuana lovers called Hi There has just come out. I'm not making that up. That is a real thing. It's a real thing. It's called the Hookup App for Stoners, which, among other things, really takes all the hassle out of disappointing your parents. You just <laughs> do it all in one swipe. Just uh <laughs> Monday and Tuesdays, I like meeting with my producers prior just so we have a good idea of what's going on. So, for instance, we can plan a game with a guest. Oh, we have this kind of guest, let's do this kind of game with them. So we work a certain game or whatever it is that we're doing in studio segment with the guests and our host. If we have a segment shoot, we'll try to shoot it that weekend. So at the writer's meeting, we'll plan out the segment shoot, uh, get a script, sh script worked out if it's not already worked out, and we'll discuss who's bringing what for the shoot, who's going to be there, and then we'll usually have a shoot that weekend or the week following. Everyone who works for the show donates countless hours to produce quality comedy. To help contribute to the masterpiece, sarcasm and witty humor are highly valued. I like working on the late show, late night show, because I enjoy making people laugh. It is something that I have enjoyed for some time now, ever since I uh, first farted at my cousin's bris, and everyone laughed. And ever since then, I was like, this is for me. We're going to get this thing started, all right? Okay. President Barack Obama is the president of the United States. How many states does he president over? 50. That's correct. One of one. Hi, you guys, 100%. OK, yeah, we're doing good. You guys are one of one. Oh, she's back. she's back! She's back! Yeah! Well, there's several responsibilities that I take care of for the show. Um, they uh, include um, writing, so I write things. Um, and sometimes they end up being humorous, and sometimes they're very stupid. Let's see. It's, um, it's definitely overwhelming, but it's definitely probably the best experience I've had in college. I really enjoy um, being able to help people's creativity flow or giving them some kind of outlet to do so. And I like making decisions, so I think I'm able to do a nice combination of those things as well as just hopefully making people laugh. It's what I say, because I, I'm not gonna promise you we're the funniest thing you've ever seen, but I definitely think we have a lot of great talent that, that wants to make people enjoy at least 20 minutes of their life.